Hello pups and welcome to Admesia Justine. Now it's been a while since I did that last Admesia playthrough. Uh, I mean, you know, like a week or so. So I figured, you know, since I'm doing a rotation, I am going to start Admesia Justine today. So I hope I do okay. Cause uh let's dive into this. <clears throat> As you can tell, I'm still a little sick, but you know, I've been pushing on to keep making these videos for you guys. I know you guys are probably very excited to see this one pop up, so hey. What do you got going on here? Oh boy. has begun My disembodied voice. It will serve you no purpose to look for me. For this is a voice from the past. I bid you welcome to my cabinet of perturbation. It is my study of the human psyche, specifically yours. A set of recordings have been prepared to chaperone you through the chambers ahead. There are a few parts to this study, and it is up to you, not only to pass, but to figure out what elements are important. Please go on move into the next chamber. Just remember, they can all be safe. There is always a way. Okay. Got an empty ass oil can. Lantern, I mean. Not in here for me, right? Okay, yeah. The hell? The 22 April 1856. Salutations, Inspector Marat. Chief of Police and Callis has turned down my request to pursue Justine Florbella for stealing my son away. Ever since their affair started, 
Elias, my son, has forsaken his duties to his family and failed to pursue his career. Since the law seems unable to find a crime within the realm of Justine's actions, I will ask you to retrieve Dr. Victor Schwartz's late later this week. He is a reliable Elenitis expert at the human psyche and no leaves. He may have found a legal way to incarcerate her. If he is able to diagnose her as a heretic, it will provide you an ample excuse to have her locked up. I trust you and your agency will not turn us down. Well. What the hell? I can see we're already going to be in for it. very shiny and what the hell is going on in here my love I know I am not as talented as Milo or as strong as Basile or Bas Eel whatever I don't know how to pronounce it <clears throat> but I am certain my love my love is truer do not my scars tell you so I'll continue to cut myself as long as it pleases you I will even kill Basile if you wish I know you say you like it But he is hurting you. I will trick him to consume a bromide for Justine. I will help. Just ask me to help. Hmm.
A very interesting little uh, situation we got going on here. Too late to set things right. Hmm. Wasn't there a rock in one of the rooms? don't want to pull that lever because I just have a gut feeling that that's just going to be a bad thing to do. How did you escape? Looks like I might just have to suck it up and put a lever, huh? Wait, hold on. Hmm.
What the hell is going on? Congratulations for coming this far. I am so excited for you. I do hope you managed to save Monsieur Fournier. He was a friend and a colleague of my papa here. Friendly fellow, a real bon garçon, but frail of mind. He puts up an impressive front, but it is all an act, I assure you. Please, go on. We are just getting started. Okay. <coughs> Travis D at the conservatory. Many Parisians have gathered last night to enjoy the performance of violin virtuoso Milo de Vigny. It was to be a grand premiere of several new arrangements of songs by fellow composer Greg Bizet. But the evening took an unexpected turn. Young Milo de Vigny turned up visibly intoxicated his violin his violin cried as the bow was jerked across the strings the audience seemed forgiven at first but started to boo the man off stage as he as he defaced the beloved song la rosa et le 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 yeah whatever the stress apparently got the best of the young musician as he threw his bow into the audience and finally collapsed. Mademoiselle just set for Flora Bell, who is, according to rumors, romantically involved with Monsieur de Vig Vigny, looked quite amused by the e event and took and had two of her friends, Bissel Gorox and Alias Ray can carry him off the stage. Ryson, Ryson. Leading was saved by other musicians and their country at the conservatory was able to perform the most delightful impromptu concerto in Emily de Vig Vigny's absence. The audience showered their saviors with praise and calls of for encore were rewarded with spectacular pieces by both Offenbach, Offenbach and Chopin. Hmm. No.
No, I guess that guy's boned. He's just stuck there. Forever. What the hell? On this next piece, you should be looking for some divine inspiration. Time to delve into your spiritual side. What do you see? Is the man begging for mercy, or is he being blessed? Perhaps both. Father used to say there were no right answers. Have the light to guide you. Results. The test has been going well. The most, the most long term and the sense, the most promising one, is a light box. Have interesting. Choose a slide. Essentially, a mode. For every day is a great way to see the larger overall development of her mind. She definitely reads things into the slides. She definitely reads things into the slides. I had not foreseen. Her remarkable imagination turns the characters into just about anything. She is able to effortlessly reduce all her experiences into one of the four character slides. Using the puzzle look has proven more difficult as she tends to always choose two slides with characters facing the same way. I have asked her why this is, but she doesn't seem to fully understand what I'm asking. <coughs> journal entries just seen age eight today I played outside with Clarice she, we saw a bird pick at the snail it carried it off and landed on a lawn fence the snail had a shell and it cracked Clarice cried and I comforted her the new maid heard us and came outside came out and scolded Clarice for playing with me the bird took off into the air today I was the one with open arms just seen age nine I've Today I played with the slides from Father's light box above. Oh, I like the man standing to the right. Father asked why. I said he sees things he likes. Today I was the right one. Father said I picked the wrong slide yesterday when I made the chambermaid cry. 
He wanted me to pick the one with the sword. While I picked the man on the right, I never picked the one with the sword. Today I was I was the one kneeling. Today father came for me in my room. I still couldn't look him in the eye. He said I shouldn't feel ashamed and that I only that I only tried to fill the void left by mother. When he wasn't looking, I took the star stone from his collect from his collection. Tell you I was the one with the sword. Mm. <clears throat> who, who are you? Who's there? You'll burn for this. You'll burn for this. Sick, twisted child. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. The kingdoms of this world are be Am I missing something? of kings, lord of lords. I don't know what the hell I'm doing. 
That's it for today, people. Thanks for watching. I just became a murderer. Like, share, subscribe. You want to see more of this? And, uh, <coughs> I'll do my best to keep uh, doing videos for you guys. I hope you enjoyed it. And I will see you on the next one. Oh, um, I probably won't be doing any videos until next Tuesday. So next Tuesday, I'll start videos up again. Um, tomorrow. Uh, my daughter and wife are going to be home from work and school. So I'm going to be spending time with them. And Friday's our anniversary. And then Monday is my daughter's birthday. So, you know, I'm going to be busy all weekend starting tomorrow. So sorry. I'm going to take a little short break again. I know. I've been taking a lot of breaks. And I'm so sorry. But, you know, but come Tuesday, I will be back at making videos again. <laughs> so... As I said, need that like, share, subscribe, notification button, bell, do that thing, you know, and uh, definitely comment. Let me know what you think. Where did I fuck up? Maybe. I mean, if you've done this before, if you played this before, if not, hey, cool. First time experience for all of us. We're learning. What the hell did I just like? Anyway, you know, and, uh, yeah, thanks. See you around. Be good, pups. Peace.